Okay, sorry to make you wait. <laughs> um, well, I'm, I'll say that uh, it probably worked out because it feels like Optimus was also kind of figuring out who he was in the first yeah. few. Yeah. yeah, so. Very much. Um, and I want to say, uh, Animated was actually the first show that I was watching as it was coming out, because all of the other stuff that I'd seen was already come out and I binge-watched. Um, <laughs> so yeah, it's, it's got a special place in my heart, and I really love the... the sh uh, I can words. I love the toys. <laughs> the toys yes. are probably my favorite line. Uh, so Mine, mine too. Yeah. That was yeah. the most fun I ever had designing a toy, or a series of toys. They're they're just amazing. They're, they're they fun. they really just uh, they sit on my shelf and they just blow me away every time. It's like they actually pulled this off. <laughs> <laughs> um, so, a question: uh, Bulkhead was pretty much new for yeah. Like he was introduced in the season in the series and then went on to be in you know Prime. Did you guys know starting out that you wanted to give him as much of the spotlight as he got, or was it? Well, he was already in the development material that I received, um, so th there was there was a bigger plan. I, what was the plan from from Hasbro's perspective? So I, I feel like he's the character that was kind of the heart of the team, and I think just naturally, given that that kind of archetype for a character, the the lovable you know giant, <clears throat> I think naturally the stories just kind of took shape that kind of put him into the forefront because he's like I I think one of the the coolest things about his character was like seeing how he had the soft spot for the Constructicons and stuff like that. So, you know, obviously, like when you look at the the product line, you know, Optimus Prime, Megatron, you know, your 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 big guns are gonna take a lot of the, the spotlight as far as what we're putting on shelves. But then, you know, we we wanted to do an extra special job for for him, in as well. So, <clears throat> for Bulkhead as well, um, and. That's why we kind of came back and wanted to revisit the design at a larger scale for the for the supreme class or leader leader class, and we had to alter the design a little bit just from a from a business perspective because my bosses didn't want me selling the same toy just bigger, you know. Uh, so, you know, we added a little bit of that 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 uh, those weapons to them, and then we you know thankfully had the headmaster <laughs> helmet to fall back on, and <laughs> yeah, so we played around with we that. We fought for that. Yeah, uh, and I will say that the bulkhead I believe was the first character that Derek designed. So so Derek uh, immediately um, responded to the idea of that character. Um, and I remember a very early sketch uh, he had of him um, just sort of sitting down and and playing with little animals oh, or something. Right. And was respond. it the, the race cars or the, the RC cars? No, that was, just, that was that was that was for the like, calendar. That was oh, for the Cartoon okay. Network calendar. But he just he just did a, like a a sketch of, of bulkhead just sitting and. You know, playing with little—I think of oh, them squirrels or yeah. dogs or something. But just you know, you just saw the softy. Do you know if there's any inspiration for uh, why it was like a new character rather than I don't know, hound or but, you know? That, I think it just kind of took shape, and I think some of that might have had to do with Sam Register kind of wanting to push you know a little bit of the old and then a little bit of the new at the same time. There was was there any? Push from Hasbro as said, "Well, it's a new product line. We need a new character that's exclusive to the show." Or not? they, you know, even even back at that time, Hasbro kind of wanted their they wanted characters that people would recognize. So we were kind of taking a risk by introducing a new character like that, who's you know a core member of your team. Right. But well, I guess that's that was part of the impetus why they wanted Red Alert and why they wanted um, Hot Shot because right. they'd already been in the previous mm -hmm. series. So yeah. So yeah, it it. it it wound up taking a different direction than we had originally planned, but you know I, that's one of those things. We took a chance, and it all worked out. Like it, they get, they get I keep—I'm going to do this all day. It's like everything just kind of came together on animated, and it worked out wonderfully. Except for season four. Season four, <laughs> still to happen. Not it makes fair. some noise. 